Hey guys, what's up? It is your boy, Firing Rhymes here. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Hey guys, what's up? It's Firing Rhymes here. I'm back with another episode of Solo Arc. I'm absolutely excited for this one, guys. Uh, trying to remember where we left off last time. I believe it was getting stone. Yeah, getting stone. What the fuck? Where am I? I uh, take a minute to recollect myself. Okay, I know where I am. Awesome. Um, <clears throat> I don't know how about you guys, I don't know if you guys had a great weekend or not, I hope you guys did. Uh, I'm doing this as of Sunday, so the weekend's pretty much over. But I'll have a little bit of time over the next few days to hopefully get some recording done. I did get a new job, which is awesome! Um, I got over at Noodles & Company, which if you know what that is, then congratulations, that worked there. Um, if you don't know what it is, it's basically like a pasta house. They also make like salads and stuff too, it's pretty cool. Um, I, I enjoy working there. So, uh, I have the next couple of days off, so I'm going to spend some time to get some recording done, and then hopefully uh, live stream somewhere in there as well. Don't know when that'll be. I'll give you guys the official heads up on Twitter. I know I talked about doing a live stream, um, it was like Friday or something like that, but a lot of stuff that happened. Um, I'll give you guys a lowdown when I do a vlog, because I don't want to talk about it too much while I'm making an actual video. But, anyways, so I believe the last thing that I was doing was I was getting the house built and turned from wood to stone. I had a raft built. We're going to go out and get metal soon. I think I was actually like the next goal was get metal. I got all hide. What level am I? I forgot so because it's been so long since I played. Okay. 28, so I'm going on 29. Okay. Yeah, okay, I gotta go get metal. That's that was the next goal. I think I was gonna wait till daytime for that one. So we'll keep on upgrading the base to stone until then. Get this stuff done. The stone takes forever in the world of arc. Actually it's kinda nice though, because like I was telling you guys, this um since I'm playing single player, I was able to edit the settings and I have it set up to triple gather rate and like triple uh Something else, I can't remember what the hell it was. But it makes it that way, like, whenever you gather stuff, it also triples your effects of gathering. So not only am I gathering at three times the amount, I'm gathering at three times the pace. So it's rounding everything up to ten, which is awesome, because now it's like, every single time I pick up a stone, if I had it set to one, like for the, uh, I think it's the gather effect, I would only pick up three stones per but instead I'm picking up 10 per because of math and all that stuff. But anyways, let's hop inside the base. It's looking good guys, we're getting the stone a rolling. We need two more of those stone foundations. Could do a wall now, but it's kind of pointless. Let's level up though. Uh, I had been doing a little bit of everything. I think I was focusing on movement speed because movement speed is really weirdly set up now. Um. I could explain if you guys want me to, but I don't think I need to. I think most people who play ARK already know what I mean, because of the new updates that came out and stuff like that. Oh, what was I saving up for? Next level, I'll get my sword, which is going to be awesome. I think we'll save up for that, see how much it will cost, and then we'll move from there. I want to get the parachute, so the wall torch. What else I need? Oh, I need to get growing stuff eventually, like starting to grow um, food. Now I can get potions and make stuff. Yeah, uh, I could get more base stuff, but I don't need to. Not yet. Parasaur saddle, don't need that. Cooking pot, we will grab that. And yeah, we'll wait till we get anything else to see what we get. I need to get the spyglass too. That's important. Spyglass is really awesome because it lets you see the levels and most far away from you. So it's like, remember when we saw that T-Rex over here? It's over here. Not. It was chasing that horse around the last time we saw it. But there was a T-Rex that was over here. Uh, and it was chasing that horse while well, I couldn't tell what level it was. I knew I was going to die anyways because I didn't have a bow at the time. I thought, like, well, no, I had a bow. I just got in the bow. And that's why I was like, eh, don't kill me. Uh, but anyways, um, it'll let us see the level of the T-Rex from a distance as well. So it'll also make it easier when we go hunting. We can see like an animal and be like, oh, well, is that going to be worth trying to kill or not? I'm thinking like maybe it might be a low level and spending six hours to kill it. Whatever, but spending a long time to try to kill it versus uh, not... Yeah, not fighting it at all, saving time. Uh, when I get guns, I'll hunt stuff a lot. But... Sword, what do I need? What do I need? I need the wooden club. I'll get the wooden club. Okay. Uh, metal sickle will be nice just to have. We got nine left. When do I get guns? Thirty-four. I got time. 
Alright, 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 alright. What should I get? 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 Standing torch and spyglass. There we go. Awesome. Let's get these last two stone. Whoa! That's cool. I didn't ever notice that they uh, made it look a little bit nicer now. For the snap points, for it at least. I think it gives you a more visual representation of what it looks like when you snap it in now. They did like a lot of UI and graphics improvement over the last update, which is awesome because it makes everything look so much smoother. Uh, nicer. Everything just looks overall a lot nicer. That's what I love about Arc. Like, they're pushing forward trying to make things look nicer. Like, I think the only thing that's really dumb that came out in the updates was that, uh, I don't know if this is still true or not, but there was like a change the birds to where you couldn't uh, upgrade their stats the same way it used to be. Like it used to be you could upgrade their stats any way you want. So say if you had two pterodons, you could get one to build it specifically for speed and another to build it specifically for like carrying stuff. I can't remember who told me, but someone tried telling me that they made it to where you can't do that anymore. And I think that if they did do that, I don't know. I, I haven't tamed anything that flies in a long time. Um, not since me and my cousin were playing it a bunch and grinding on a bunch of servers during summer last year before I started recording this a lot. Um, anyways, if they did do that, that would suck. I think that'd be kind of pointless to do because it's like everybody enjoys being able to have their birds do different things. And now that if you do that, it kind of takes away like people having different birds for different stuff. I don't know. It just seems like it takes away a lot of the effect that it's supposed to have as being able to upgrade your um, birds to different things. Okay, We're still focusing on the walls here. Uh, how close are we to being done? Still have a lot of walls to go. Uh, I know I've been picking stone up, but at this point I'm probably just gonna start hitting the rocks right next to me to get it faster. And get a little bit of metal in the process. Hell oh, yeah. Well, what, oh, oh yeah, I also needed to save up my uh... What was I saving up? Saving up something. I'm encumbered, I need my wood back. Gimme, 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 gimme. Let's take this deck of 35 for now. You can get more later. Um, I'm gonna take the whole stack, never mind. There we go. Uh, anyways, I lost my chance of power. Oh yeah, getting metal tools and stuff, that was uh, my next priority, wasn't it? Because I wanted metal tools that I could get things really fast and really efficiently. I'd be able to get go from like probably a bunch of rocks at once to almost all of them at once just hitting one stone like that. Uh, it'd also make it getting metal super fast. I can get so much metal so quickly. Alright, let's put this 32 wood back in here. Like that. Did I ever make a storage box? I just thought about that. I think I did over here for the boat, but did I destroy it? Oh yeah, I did destroy it. Okay, so we'll make a large storage box after I get the walls done. I'm like getting so much at this point that it's hard to not store it somewhere. Let's go over and check out the care package. I completely forgot about that because I'm high enough level. What? Oh yeah, that's right. There was a raptor on the other side of this beach. That's why I wasn't going over there because that's where I was spawning earlier and I died eight different times in the first episode. Okay, okay, what I get, what I get, what I get, what I get, what I get. Large bear trap, behemoths, gates, mammoth saddle. Okay. Um let's do I'm gonna need pillars at some point. Now I can build big bases, but I'm not too concerned. Let's get the wall torch. I want it just because it's funny to have, but I, and I never used it, but I also don't want to waste two engram points. I should probably save up some for saddles, but... Did I already get the pterodon saddle? Is that is that something I already got? Stego... Manta, bear trap... What level do I get the terra saddle? It was like somewhere around here, I believe. 38, I think. I think that's the terra saddle. I need the pterodon saddle, that way I can fly around the map and make it easier to get around. Oh, you guys don't have to watch me for five minutes travel on a boat. Okay, um, let's do... I pay attention to the time here on how long I've been recording. Uh, let's do a little bit of base stuff. Actually, compass so we can get GPS. We'll do the paintbrush so we can paint the doors and stuff like that and paint my stuff. 
What was that? That's the first time I ever heard that noise in this game, and it actually terrified me. I did not know where that came from. <laughs> I thought that was something that went on in real life near me. The fuck is that? That doesn't help. I'm fucking all bogged down because I have so much. What am I? Why can't I make more? Oh, I'm sure on stone. What the fuck? Mm, into my way towards it. Just keep on picking stuff up and making them. That way I can slowly get rid of wave. Let me get closer to the fire because I have no idea what the fuck made that sound. That honestly kind of concerned me a little. Is that enough to make wood? George. Let's make that now. Light a little bit of weight up and then I can start putting stuff in it. Anyways, back to what the fuck I was saying. Uh, I keep on hearing weird noises and it's freaking me out. Okay, uh, let's snap that in right there. I think put all of our seeds and stuff inside of it. Take my seeds. I think I have it alphabetically organized too. I can't remember. Is it alphabetically organized or is it by type? I know my inventory isn't, but I think Amar, Azul, Save a Root, Stem. Yeah, I think it's alphabetically organized. Could which would make sense because the fiber is going in there after the A's and the fiber is F. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. I can throw my hide in there real fast, so if I die, I don't lose it. Into berries, rocker root, narco, mejo. Okay. I think, uh, yeah, I'll put on my metal in there too. I'll keep my wood. Right, what was I doing? Oh, I was debating on what the fuck to get for my upgrade points. Okay. I was like debating on what to get, and I freaked out because I heard what looked or what sounded like a dire wolf howling, so it freaked me out. Um, anyways, we should should we get something for the base? Should we get like windows and hatch frames, or should I focus more on the farming? I don't even think I have the small rock or plot yet. Drop plot. Where's that? Where's that little thing at? That should be. I think it's lower than this. I could type it in, but I don't feel like it. Eh, wooden spike walls, I could get those at some point. I don't really need, like I don't need a lot of defensive stuff because I'm not playing online, so I don't have to worry about getting raided. Unless my buddies decide to join me, which I don't think they can. Where the fuck is a small crop lot at? It's gotta be like around here, I swear to God. I feel like you guys are seeing it every single time I mention it and just like, Trying to point it out to me like, Brandon, you're stupid. I know I didn't get it. Where the fuck is it? Spot grenade. There's a medium crop plot. Okay, so it's got to be a little higher up. Small feeding trough. I don't see it, and I'm losing my mind. Oh my god, I'm gonna type it in. Fuck it. Mm. Load. There we go. Because I'm tired of looking. I'm tired of trying to find it. I can't see it. There we go. It's a level 10. What the fuck? Oh, I already have it. That's why I couldn't. I, I wouldn't die. Alright. Uh. There we go. Okay, I can only see what I haven't earned yet. That's a little helpful. That makes it a little easier to see what I haven't gotten yet. Alright, um, that's cool. Awesome. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess since I haven't gotten that, then we could probably go ahead and get. We could get a six and a three. We could get sixes. We get a nine. I've gotten those before. I legitimately wasted my points to get one of those before just because it was funny to play with. Um, let's go ahead and get. We'll, uh, yeah, I guess I could get these. Narcotic trip wire, don't need that. I'm just gonna save them. I'll save them till later. I legitimately spent all that time trying to figure out if I wanted to get something, not to not get anything. Look at that torch away, cause I feel like something. Gonna come. 
I just like really, it, it feels like I'm playing online right now. So like anytime I play online, I hear noises that I don't know. Like it freaks me out sometimes. And since I don't know what the fuck was making the howling noise, I'm like a little frightened, a little shook at what it could be. What do I still have that's weighing me down? I know there's a shit ton of berries. I can throw all those away for the narcos. I'll use the narco berries later. Actually, how much do I have? I saw an animal over there. I freaked out again. What do I have? Don't I have a more fast elevator? I do! Okay. Uh, put the stems in there for stem berries, but I don't need those. Let's take out the spark powder. Put in the meat. Consumables, drugs. Don't make drugs at home, kids. It's bad for you. Where do I need to make stimulants? Spark powder. I'm not gonna waste my spark powder for that. Put my spark powder in here. I'll just smelting metal later. Still have shit weighing me down. What the fuck else is weighing me down? I got rid of the berries. I got a lot of wood. Wood's weighing me down. I got these two spears, but that only adds so much. I don't know. I'll just keep on going. I think it might be just the wood. The wood adds a lot of weight. And stone does a mass bulk. Keep on going. I see you over there, little pelican thing flying. That should be enough to get a couple more stone walls. Three. Yeah, I need one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. I need nine more stone walls. And I'll be all done with the walls. I can throw the ceiling. This is legitimately, these videos, like the past, I think, four have been nothing but me building a base. I haven't even gotten to actually all the cool stuff of getting to make guns and stuff like that. It's almost there, guys. I promise. I just gotta push a little further. My mortar, can I build one? What the fuck? Oh, I'm on thatch. I didn't see that. Give me your thatch. There we go. Ah, let's level up. Movement speed again. Right, what I get this time? Toggle the unlearned. Here we go all the way down to what level I just hit. 32. Diplodicus, Lance, Toilet. What the fuck? There's a toilet? <laughs> I haven't seen those before, that's awesome! <laughs> Alright, we'll save up for the guns. Actually, I think I need to get the spyglass at this point if I haven't already got it. I have got it, okay. Okay. So we'll save up a little bit till we hit gun levels. And then we'll get some gun stuff going. Now I can jump in and show off the guns or off the bat. Gotta see the gun show. I gotta get flint badly. I just realized I'm gonna need so much flint. I got seven, two more. Awesome, that's exactly how many I have left. Alright, let's go fix these walls, guys. We're gonna be all done with the walls, and then the next episode's gonna be doing the ceilings. I promise you guys I'm not boring. It's just a lot of. I actually hate my life. I did not think that would snap in like that, so that honestly just kind of upset me a little. Look over here for those T-Rex, make sure he's not running over here towards me. Do I have enough for one more, please, please, please? I do! I have enough for two more, actually. We'll build that doorway. Yeah, we're almost... Done. I gotta get a door this episode. It's this established. I have to get a door. Give me some stone. Give me some stone. Give me some stone. There we go. It should be enough. Yes. Guys, the walls are done and the foundation's done. I got an all stone base except for the ceiling. I think, like, legitimately, out of all the things that I could have recorded, I've been itching so badly to record arc and play arc. They're like. Okay, I thought the freak rain shower just like immediately stopped, and I was like, what the fuck? Alright. Uh, and we're going on 19 minutes, okay. Alright guys, that's the end of this episode, then I hope you guys enjoy this one. I'm going to immediately get back into this, because this is awesome. I love playing Ark, and it's with all the new updates and stuff like that, so. I hope you guys enjoy this one, I'm going to catch you guys all in the next episode. Hope you guys have a very fantastic day. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Don't forget to